time with Matt. Uh, today I've got my good friend uh, Dan, or Daniel. Hello. Um, and we are, it's Dan's first flight, so he's a bit nervous, he's just been for a nervous week. Uh, third nervous week. And we're, uh, we're going to head over to the East Coast, up to Filey and Bridlington, and I think we're going to land at Edsfield as well. So are you excited? Very. Very excited? Yeah. Good, good. No more nervous wheeze? No, no, I'm good. That's good. We're just waiting for the uh, oil temperature to come up and then we'll, uh, then we'll be away. Edsfield is a private farm strip located 9.4 nautical miles west of Bridlington in the Yorkshire Wolds. There is a single grass runway 750 metres long orientated 0927. The airfield sits at 500 feet above sea level and all circuits are carried out to the north. Yeah, yeah. 
That's either Finley or Bridlington, uh, or uh, Flandre. That's Scarborough, I think, up there. Which is further up. It gives you perspective as to how... I know we say there's a lot of space, yeah. and there is, but how small we actually are as yeah, well. Yeah, big time. <laughs> Do you know what I mean? If you were doing this in Australia, um, or the States, or... You, you're not, you'd fly you're not, for 10 hours. Yeah, exactly. You're not seeing cores straight away, are you? <laughs> do some turning. We'll do some gentle turns. Right, so we'll have a quick look around. Clear, clear above. So we'll, we'll do a turn to the left. Should we go left? Okay, do it. Starting to feel a little bit of G-force now. A really, really gentle turn. Keeping it in balance, that's the balance. Keep it in the middle. And we're not going up or down. So this is probably a 20 degree turn. So the more you go over... Yeah. The feel. You start to feel the G-force. Yeah. Feel it now? Yeah. Right, giraffe. Right on the arm. It's cold on the hands, isn't it? Mm. Gloves. With some gloves. Some, yeah. But if you have gloves, you can't operate all this stuff. Yeah, I suppose, yeah. Pink, pinkless. Pinkless. Some gy gypsy gloves. Yeah. <laughs> Market trade the gloves. <laughs> Wanna buy some pegs? Yeah. Yeah. We're four and a half thousand feet now. So much for staying at three thousand. It's because I'm talking. And I'm not concentrating. Around here that's alright, but if I were somewhere else with airspace, yeah. I could have busted airspace. Yeah. You've got to really concentrate. Yeah. Yeah. Have a go. You are? Want to have a go? I don't think I do. <laughs> go for it, show them. Just very gentle inputs, left and right. You'll, you'll get the feel, it's very sensitive. So just turn it to the left a little bit. A bit more. You've got to manhandle this place. You've got to really manhandle it. To the right. Don't like it. That's it, like that. And then just keep it rolling. And I'm balancing it with my feet. Yeah, I don't like it. Right, <laughs> level, level up. Right, if you pull back very gently, we'll, we'll start to climb. Push forward, we'll start to go down. Yeah. Good, eh? Traffic stop, Echo Delta to final, 27. That, that's my mate, that. He's, he's just landed. Right, I'll have it now. You we can relax again. <laughs> Ed's field is there, look, it's where we're going to land. Oh, yeah, yeah. So we'll actually fly past it. So last, last time I tried to land there, I couldn't find it, so I had to go, el I had to go elsewhere. I just couldn't see it anywhere. Field Radio, Golf Charlie, India, Bravo, Victor, Sky Ranger, inbound from Sherman. Request uh, airfield information, please. Golf Echo Delta to Golf Bravo, Victor, uh, 27, right down, QFE is 993. Golf Echo Delta. 27 right hand, QFE 993, Hector Pasco, um, thank you very much for that. Golf Bravo, Victor. See you soon, Golf Echo Delta. Put the kettle on, Golf Bravo Victor. It's 500 feet, so the circuit height is 1,000 feet. But unlike Sherburn, it's 1,000 feet up, uh, it's 500 feet up on a hill. So, I was, so, th so this pressure is set to Sherburn's pressure. Right. So even though the circuit's 1,000 feet, this should read 1,500. Right, okay. However, my mate, who has just landed, has just told us the pressure's that. 993. So if I change that to this, can you see the altitude changing? 993. So that is now an accurate altitude, uh, pressure for that airfield. It's a very narrow runway, so we have to be very precise. Very narrow. Good, good. So 
sure you should. Four Bravo Victor, downwind from way 27, right hand. Okay, so we're downwind. Right, so we'll do some quick checks. So fuel is sufficient, fuel pump is on. Flap is clean. We're trimmed. Are you nice and secure? Yep, yep. Landing lights on. T's and P's, they're all good. Now apparently you're not to fly over the crematorium, if you can help it. So we'll try, try, not, try and abash that. Yeah, <laughs> makes sense to be respectful. Absolutely. So, uh, first stage of flap, and trim. Right down the runway, which is good for us. Windy. Okay, second stage of flat. And trim all the way back. We're closed. Go Bravo Victor, final runway 27 for full stop landing. We're coming in over some trees, so we don't want to hit the trees, do we, Dan? We definitely don't want to hit the trees. So I'm going to just increase the power a little bit. Rising, so this is a powered approach. So we're just riding in the, a little bit on a little bit of power. And then we're going to get over these trees and then we'll, we'll drop down. Okay, we'll close the throttle there. Black space, fine. Four Bravo Victor, backtracking 27. Okay. So we can put the flap away and trip to centre. And we'll go and have a wee. Yeah. Yeah. Beautiful spot for it, isn't it? This wee in the tea. On side, yeah, wee in the tea. On side of a hill. It's a beautiful spot, isn't it? Yeah. No, it was like. Yeah, probably the prettiest place I've ever wanted. <laughs> nice little Manchester Airport. <laughs> it's lovely here. Find it down there. It's a nice place, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, that's what I learned in uh, the same. Right. Not that one, but it's exactly the same. Okay. What's the next, what, what's like the next thing for you? Like, what would you like to be in next? Well, I'll find this for a number of years still, get my experience up, and then I'll do an additional rating on my licence, then you can fly um, anything pretty much single seat then. Uh, radio transponder off, right, so we'll uh, we'll say bye for now, we're going to go and have a tea and a wee, aren't we? Uh, and have a quick nosy around, speak to my pal in the, in the Eurofox, and then we'll, uh, we'll be off again.